Omni asset. So the idea is that we want to have, well, what we need is that if we're going to release these tokens into the wild, we need to be able to announce ahead of time that, oh, as of this block height, we are going to redeem X percent of the outstanding tokens, and we are going to replace them with this other token. So in the case of BFX, we want to be able to replace it one for one with, on some pro rata basis, uh, replace, shall we say, BFX tokens with Tether tokens. And that's, that's, that's a necessary prerequisite for Omni before we can actually issue Omni tokens that can be extracted and traded away from us. So you'll be able to do that remotely, like no matter where the, those BFX tokens are, you'll be able to redeem them remotely. Yes, um, but that's exchanges, cool. exchanges are going to have to be willing to support that. I mean, it's it, it, it's a little complicated. The, the cool thing is, is that we're forcing the industry to do something that we've wanted to do for a couple of years. And I think that it's gonna, it's really cool. And I think it's really interesting. And this type of functionality, if we can show that it works, I think it's going to be very, uh, it's going to be, it's going to have utility in another, another in a multitude of applications. Blue circle tether is actually backed by US dollars already, so you don't have to trust it. It's uh, the, the amount of tether in existence has a one to one value with USD that's in an actual bank, so there's no issues there. They do, they do, and okay. So just just to address the fud surrounding this, yes, we Bitfinex are majority owners of a bit of of tether. This is true, but tether is a completely segregated entity. Um, Dollars are all there. Everything. I mean, there's there, there's no breaches there. It's like everything there is 100% kosher. We take great pains to make sure it is. So, um, I don't know what else I could do to make people feel comfortable about that. Doubt I will, but um, it. But that's a completely separate thing. So, and and a hundred percent accounted for. I have a, a, a sort of off-topic question and very much not probing question. Um, a, a few days ago, I, I was reading about Tether uh, before I knew anything about really Bitfinex. And uh, I, I was trying to figure out what bank it is. And since if you're majority owners, then maybe you would know something about that and where their offices are located and what bank specifically they, they have there and what jurisdiction they're operating in. Okay, so we have several banks. Um, in multiple jurisdictions, our principal banking relationships are in Taiwan. Our back office is there as well. Um, we operate through the same money service operator license that Bifinex operates through in, uh, in Hong Kong, but that's not re terribly relevant to our operations, but um, well, that's what I can tell you right now. Okay, thanks.